Hello students, welcome to the Baiju's Exam Prep Spotlight, a show where we bring our toppers into the spotlight and listen to their inspirational, motivational journey of their success. And yes, today we have with us a student who comes from a very small town, Metapalayam, but still had always higher aspirations, higher dreams about his career. With such high aspirations, he appeared in the gate examination and has finally secured all India rank one. Yes, he has aced the gate 2022 examination in electronics and communication engineering with all India rank one gate score 1000 out of 1000. Here we have Mr. Ram Balaji with us. So welcome Ram to the show. Thank you, sir. So I, I believe you must be very happy. Your family must be full of joy right now listening to this big success of yours. Yes, sir, definitely. Everyone are happy. Okay, great. So uh, to begin up uh, this discussion, Ram, let me just know something about yourself, your educational background, uh, your uh, anything about uh, you would like to mention about yourself. Yeah. So I did my schooling in, here in Metapalayam and uh, I, I got selected in IIT and uh, recently I got graduated from IIT doing my, my B.Tech in Engineering Physics okay. and uh, I gave my gate this year and secured All India Rank 1 in okay. EC paper. Okay, okay, okay. So, uh, as you just mentioned, you have just graduated. So, yeah. uh, when did you actually start thinking about the gate examination? When did you make up your mind? Yes, this is going to be your journey because engineering students, you know, sometimes uh, choose gate or some other choose different examinations also. Yeah. So, what was your uh, decision point and what made you decide to prepare for gate? So, by, by my third year, I was interested to get into ele electronics related field. So when I started looking for opportunities, I could not find many opportunities coming from the field of engineering physics. Okay. So I thought uh, giving gate would be a good idea to do my master's or go for higher studies. Mm -hmm. And also like it will be a kind of uh, mark in the, making my mark in the field if I get a good score. 100%. So that is when I started to prepare in my third year. Oh. And uh, yeah, uh, I gave my gate in my third year and I got 57 out of 100 with limited preparation okay. and I secured all India ranking 139 at that point. Okay. So that really inspired me to give gate the second time as well. Right. And uh, I'm really happy that it turned out to be all India ranking one. So uh, I think this should also be an inspiration to the third year students that uh, <laughs> third year means those who are in second year right now, those who can appear in the gate mm -hmm. in third year, since now third year students are eligible. Ram secured All India rank 139, right? And uh, he felt, and that was with a very small preparation, and he felt definitely it is not sufficient. 57 marks he has got with less preparation. So if he prepared with full dedication, he can come up with the better results and what could be much better than All India rank 1. So I think this is even a great motivation for uh, the students which are in second year right now, those who may be aspiring to give in the gate in third year, because usually take the students take the third year attempt as very light, as very casual. But uh, if you give your best in third attempt, Ram was even not very serious, but still he got 57 and 130 rank he retried with his best attempt he has got the best rank all india rank one but yes if you really try hard in third year so there are two important things you may be first successful within third year right as i have mentioned i got my all india rank nine within third year or if not you have chance to improve yourself even if you get rank rank like 100 200 or anything that will give you the experience the real feel of gate examination and final year you can come up with your best possible uh results so great great to know about your journey um so ram uh definitely okay uh, it's a big competitive examination right getting all india rank one itself is a big achievement so when you are preparing for this examination, at the time of preparation, no student can say whether it's going to be rank 1 or rank 10 or rank 20. But yeah, definitely when you are preparing seriously, there will be some hurdles, some challenges that will come in every aspirant's path. So personally, what challenges you face? Did you face any challenges? Were there anything or any subjects that were a little bit disturbing you? Uh, so like uh, when preparing uh, for the th uh, in my first attempt in the third year, I did not expect any any good mark or something. I just wanted to uh, prepare my best and give my best. So when I got 57 out of 100, uh, it was really uh, inspiring for me to uh, try it in the uh, fourth year as well to, with my full preparation. So I was aiming for R1 actually when I started my preparation. Mm. So after it started after my internship in July. So after July only, I started preparing uh, very seriously for uh, GATE 2022. Okay. 
and uh, yeah so while preparing for uh, gate uh, i had to cover uh, some of the syllabus with, which was left out apart from my uh, course work covered in in btech mm -hmm. so analog circuits really took a very long time for me to cover i felt difficulty in that subject okay. but uh, i'm happy to say that i like i really did well in that and i also got placed in an analog design engineer role right. so, so okay yes. so uh, with all india rank when it's good to know that uh, you know yeah while preparing you overcome your hurdles you try yeah. more and more on your difficult areas and now at the same time you are also placed in analog devices yeah. right analog devices so what is uh, your future uh, step now in what uh, where you are looking yourself whether you will be taking a psu or some mtech admission or going towards analog device devices what's your end goal so uh, for now i'll be uh, going uh, for job as analog design engineer in texas instruments actually mm -hmm. and uh, yeah so gate is valid for 3 years uh, and depending on however life takes me i would like to use the opportunity when and where possible yeah. but initially it was for me to uh, go for ir studies if i don't get placed if oh. i don't get sufficient opportunities for myself so oh. that was the initial focus of on attempting gate right so that is what I, in in short i can also say that if a student is technically sound especially preparing for gate will make you technically sound so uh, you may get the best rank in gate at the same time that same preparation helps you getting the good core placement like uh, yeah. you know, ram has got it so guys uh, we also keep saying preparing for gate will make you smart it will up to you that whether you would like to go for higher education or psu or even private core companies okay that every individual can have their own choice but first you have to become eligible for that without eligibility without that much of knowledge we just keep on thinking ki your dreams are high but our preparation and our you know steps are low right so students if your dreams are high your preparation and your steps taken should also be definitely matching with those dreams as ram uh, had this so ram i would just like to ask one more thing that how did you know uh, how did you come to know about byju's exam prep and what is the best thing you liked about byju's mm -hmm. exam prep so byju's i got to know through youtube i used to watch the youtube uh, video series for example maha marathon series okay. and uh, yeah it was helpful for me to quickly revise through the concepts right. and also the questions they were solving like it was really very enthusiastic the way uh, the teachers were solving them yeah yeah definitely definitely at the end time we try to plan see we plan keep on planning classes at several uh, points of the year but especially at the end time we plan yeah. revision marathon because in the short time we know students uh, like especially most of your studies uh, i believe were self study most of you yeah, like yes. on the self study preparing through books or uh, online videos so there are several such students and you know they can quickly revise easily mm -hmm. this available long marathons and that is what we specially designed my question was ki uh, three persons okay uh, jinko aap credit doge for your success it could be your parent okay, my friends, life okay, okay fine. anything in your life any any three persons okay what will be those three names uh firstly of course my parents right. like without them without uh, they are bringing up to uh, this mark i will never be reaching or be where i am right now they right. are hard work and they are dedication that it inspires me a lot okay. secondly my friends i would like to mention a few people's name uh, danusha nasrat and jitendra right. and also sanjit these are my close friends right. and uh, yeah they really helped me a lot uh, in this preparation journey right. and uh, thirdly my relatives and also they play a very major role in right. motivating me yes sir Yes, and so also I mean, like <laughs> again three people it is very uh, small even my okay. professors and others as well play a major role in this definitely yeah it's it's uh, three is a very limited number but yeah, yes. i believe always the people and the surrounding near you will uh, be very much responsible on uh, how successful you can be okay they can support you in making your career and they yeah. can also be responsible sometimes for destroying yeah. somebody's career right directly or indirectly so good to see that you had positive uh, surroundings nearby mm -hmm. you so uh, how many tests if you remember uh, how many test you appeared before going to the gate examination be it mock test or subject wise test or topic test any rough idea you uh, have about it i don't uh, actually have a count but roughly i would say like uh, each topic i uh, have appeared for like like each uh, there is a subject wise and in, in subject each topic i would say like on an average like five to six test 
Okay. Aerobic for test. each topic. Mock test, yeah. Yeah. So and those the, mock tests will contain some five to ten questions. Definitely. Yeah. So yeah, even whether it is five to ten question, every yeah. test, every quiz gives you a learning, gives yes. you an experience. So. So I believe in GATE itself, the syllabus is huge. And if we keep on counting the number of topics and multiply by four to five, then it's going to be a huge number. Yeah, definitely. Yeah. So uh, this is what is the story of behind most of the toppers. They appear in lots of quizzes and lots of tests. All students, please take it seriously. We keep on telling you. But yes, All India Rank 1 is telling you this time that how important test is. So practice is uh, really very important. Exactly. So yeah. what is actually the benefit you got from these many tests? Sometimes you may be scoring good. Sometimes you may be scoring bad. How did you learn? How did you analyze the test series? And what uh, game yeah. aspirant should learn from this test series? So when I'm scoring good, it will really be motivating for me to try more questions. But also there will come a time when I'm not scoring good. I'm not getting the concepts right. That is when there will be a slight lack of motivation. But during that time, I used to like, again, uh, go back to my notes, revise the topics, and again, try to uh, get as much as possible from that mistake I have made and try try to like uh, uh, learn from that mistake and then not repeat it next time so that in the next coming questions, I'm able to uh, do it with full confidence. Yes, right. sir. Okay. So, uh, you know, be it uh, the test series part, as you are mentioning, be it the previous year questions, right? yeah. be it on the practice or concept part, I would like your message to the fellow gate aspirants, those who are going to appear in <laughs> gate 23 or gate 24 or any of the upcoming year, right? What should be their preparation strategy? How much they should focus on the test, previous year question, concepts and everything? Yes, sir. So initially, I would like to uh, tell them to take at least one previous year question paper and solve it. Try to solve it fully before starting your preparation so that you can assess yourself where you are standing, how you are able to solve. And then, like I would say you to uh, go cover the syllabus, uh, do the mock test simultaneously, try to improve yourself. And then once you're done with everything, then uh, come again and try to attend the same paper to know how you have improved in the subject. And then you can start attempting other previous question papers. And then you have full length mock tests available. So these everything will at the final uh, time will help you to prepare for the actual gate exam. Definitely. Right. So uh, time management or uh, selecting the questions which yeah. to attempt, it will be really helpful. Yeah. So some students are a little bit, uh, you know, hesitating about the test or practice area. Some students will appear in the test series, but not analyze as you are mentioning and without mm -hmm. any analysis, the test series or the practice area is not helpful. They will, you know, solve a sheet of uh, question or maybe they'll solve some workbook. But once mm -hmm. they solve, they will keep it aside. You know, out yeah. of the workbook, there may be some questions they solved. There is some question they did not solve. Okay, so yes, we have to revisit what we study so that whatever, you know, if if in the previous attempt, we uh, were able to solve 60% question, let us see next attempt, whether it becomes 80, then it has mm -hmm. to be 90 and gradually the yeah, yeah. journey goes on. That is what. So I believe GATE is also all about enjoying your journey of preparation. Yes. So I yeah. personally will share that, you know, when I started, okay, it was a casual preparation, but one or two months down the line, when I actually went into the serious preparation, I actually started enjoying. None of the day was burdened for me. And I actually, at the end of every night, I'm waiting for the next day. Tomorrow I have this task and I'm readily happy to complete it. So Ram, did you also enjoy your journey or, or, or did you feel it burdened? <laughs> did you feel it pressure? Or did you were enjoying no. it? Yes, something good is happening. So I don't know what is the result maybe, but I am doing good. Yeah, so uh, my preparation was mostly focused on practicing a lot rather than like mostly on uh, sitting and taking notes, revising on theory. Uh, rather than that, I used to practice a lot. So there used to be a lot of ups and downs. Someday I will be able to solve all the questions. Some other day I will like not even one question will be right. So uh, yeah, even I enjoyed a lot solving those questions. If it is not right also, like I used to, it used to motivate me to be um, right in the next time while I solve it. So that kept motivating me. There is also a fun factor to it. So yes. yeah, my journey was also fun filled. Yes, sir. Yeah, definitely students. So gate is always a little long journey. It's not like a few days or one or two month journey. And you have to adapt to that journey. You have to start enjoying it, right? Results 
what if don't think about your results right now it will be positive if you start enjoying your journey right if you take it as a burden if you take it as a pressure half of the efficiency is lost because mm -hmm. your mind is much diverted into worrying about things so let's not worry let's enjoy this preparation so uh thank you ram for joining us for this wonderful discussions i hope many of the fellow future aspirants will be motivated highly inspired from your success and they would be definitely willing to crack the gate with all india rank 1 in the upcoming year thank you ram so much thank you sir all the best to the upcoming aspirants for yes. gate 2023 definitely and all the best ram for your future endeavors whatever your dream maybe you come up with the you know brightening results in every area of life thank you so much thank you sir